We're here at EclipseCon, and one of the highlights of EclipseCon is the, the, what I call the people counter. So it's, it's really showing Eclipse IoT in action. And, and I'm going to let Marco, who is kind of the genius of all this, to, to talk about um, what, what, what we've done here. Yeah. Thank you, Ian. Hi. Um, so for EclipseCon this year, we actually put together a real-world demo. We wanted to show how all the different technologies that Eclipse has under its own umbrella can be combined to do an IoT solution, something that shows end-to-end. -end. And we actually tried to use real sensors this time, things that actually measure valuable data and show how you can actually collect the data, transport the data, and analyze the data using technologies in the Eclipse stack. Okay. So we have people counter sensors, uh, they're actually coming from Eurotech, the company I'm working for. Right. They actually measure people coming in and out of opening. We have four of them installed on this side and on the other side. Okay. Yeah. And they'll actually be able to measure the people that go to the tutorial and the, the keynotes. Okay. Now, once you have the sensor data to make actually business value out of that data and extract it, you need to be able to transport it and put it into a business intelligence type of application sure. or a big data type of right. application. That's where the Eclipse technology stacks come into place. So we're going to look at the screen here. So exactly. The big screen here. This is the result, basically, okay. of everything that we okay. had done, right? So in the collect, we actually used Raspberry Pis running Eclipse Cura, which is our you know, Eurotech right. contribution into the Eclipse OSGI IoT project. And stuff. Exactly. Yeah. The beauty of that is Java-based, so it's portable. It runs on Raspberry or it runs on industrial hardware right. if you need to, right? Yeah. In this case, to show the portability, we use the Raspberries. Java and OSGI, so very modular, very easy to manage over time. If you have hundreds of those, it still runs. Thousands yeah. still runs. You can still manage it. The data is transported through MQTT using other projects like Eclipse Mosquito, right. collected into the Everywhere Cloud, and then for the business intelligence, we use Eclipse Bird, another great project. So the guys from Actuate, you guys uh, paired up with Actuate to, to help put That's together? That's fine. We had a lot of time together, right. and uh, that's the result. So what so do we have here? So yeah, what exactly. So, so, so this is Monday. So this is live data? Yeah. So all the numbers here are live data. They are refreshed every minute. Okay. Right? And you can see here already the historical trend of the three days of the conference. Okay. Right? So the gray bar here is actually showing people walking in the rooms, out of the rooms, in the rooms, and out of the rooms. You can see during the session, uh, the lunch, basically right. they walked out, tutorial started again, and they yep. go, it went yep. in again. And we're going to be seeing similar patterns, we expect, in the next, in the okay. next three cool. days. In the main room where the keynote is, we actually have an environmental monitoring station by Eurotech, right. which actually measures all these environmental parameters. So it's only 72 degrees in there now? Mm, yeah, that seems to be. Yeah, there are not many other people. Yeah. It's usually conference centers get very cold for me, so, so we'll, we'll, see how, we'll see how they <laughs> we'll do We'll see how it goes through the okay. keynote tomorrow. Exactly. So what does the pressure do? What's the pressure for do? Um, it's one of the, the, the metrics that we measure. So I think where we are going to be seeing interesting patterns tomorrow, okay. it's going to be as more people walk in, we are actually going to see CO2 going higher. Right. We consume oxygen, right? Everybody will walk in with cell phones and laptops, so we're going to see the electromagnetic field going higher, too. Cool. Yeah, exactly. So we're going to be talking Hopefully to the internet won't crash. Hopefully <laughs> right. the internet won't crash. Right. But even if it does, the sensor will measure it, right? Right. So we're going to be trying to show some of those correlations together That's great. between so population and that. So it's all Cura? It's all Cura. Cura on the collect side, and right. on the transport. We have a database to collect the data temporarily, and then Eclipse Bird for to, to all the visualization. And with High quality Eurotech hardware and running high it quality all. industrial grade sensors, which, which people counting, and environmental Actually, the sensors are cool. Station. We have to go get a picture of the sensor because I thought that was very That's cool. And we we'll get a close that, up yeah. of the, the people counter. So, perfect. Thank you. Thank you so much.